I'm Jason, the world is yours, and today we're taking a look at photos of the Nike John Morant 1 Guava Ice sneaker colorway. Nike has remained supportive of Memphis Grizzlies star John Morant throughout his NBA suspension. Now, let's explore the upcoming John Morant 1 Guava Ice sneaker colorway, part of the highly anticipated lineup set to drop later this year, 2023. The sneaker boosts a color scheme featuring Guava Ice, medium soft pink, white black, and light Ultra Marine, is that how you pronounce that? I've never, I don't even know what that is. And Hyper Pink, there's a lot of colors going on. Constructed with a blend of mesh and leather, the Nike Jaw One showcases a guava ice upper accompanied by soft pink TPU swooshes. Jaw branding is predominantly displayed on the tongues and um, insoles, notably the Ultra Marine heel showcases Jaw Morant number 12 embroiled on the back tab is mismatched colors the design is completed by a white midsole uh, complemented by black and pink rubber outsole um, featuring jaws logo on the ultramarine <laughs> under underneath check out the photos below um and look for the nike jaw morant one guava ice is expected to launch in men's and grade school sizes grade school is uh kids sizes uh sneakerheads call them grade school but it doesn't look like it's going to be available in women um these sneakers will be available in stores at select nike basketball retailers and online at nike.com the retail price is set at a very affordable only 110 dollars that's a very affordable sne basketball sneaker um i like these i like these a lot um you know, because the price is one hundred and ten dollars, I don't know if I would. I don't. I just don't know if I would buy them. I don't. The color. It's a cool colorway. It just. It doesn't really work for me. I've seen other colorways in this sneaker that I think I would like better than this colorway, and with the price only being hundred and ten dollars, it's extremely affordable. But just for me personally, um, I don't think I would buy these sneakers. All things being equal, I would wear them. I wouldn't change the laces. I like the laces. Um, I just don't see myself going out and buying them. I do like the Ja Morant one um, silhouette. This is a very dope silhouette. So I've seen other colorways that, you know, I would prefer to buy. But this specific colorway, um, I just don't see myself going to buy this uh, one, right? You know, the silhouette, it's a very dope silhouette. The laces, dope laces, matches the toes and the tongue. Um, a lot of colors here, but, you know, no problems. I like, I definitely like the um, mismatch bottom. I like black bottoms instead of, you know, white bottoms that get dirty very quickly. Or even pink bottoms that would get dirty, dirty very quickly. But, you know, like I said, all things being equal, I would wear these. I wouldn't have a problem wearing these. I just don't see myself putting down $110 for this specific colorway because there's other colorways that I would prefer to buy for this sneaker. But let me know your opinion of these sneakers. Uh, I'm Jason. The world is yours. Today, we were taking a look at photos of the Nike Ja 1 Guava Ice sneaker colorway. No specific release date. I would imagine it's going to release, you know, around the NBA season or, you know, before or after the NBA season, if that makes any sense. Of course, there's always a before and after. But, you know, basically around the NBA season time, um, maybe when he comes back or something like that, because he's going to be suspended for a few games when the season starts. But the retail price is set at a very affordable $110. Uh, let me know your opinion on these sneakers. Um, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the $1 donation button, and please tune in to the next video on this channel. Thanks a million for watching.